malaria and the poverty are bad fellows. If you have little money, you buy medicine, you become poor. If you become poor, you get malaria because you are not able to afford treatment. In terms of man hours lost, we lose almost 60 million hours a year. It becomes a vicious cycle. So when you have a critical mass of nets out in the community and people are actually sleeping in them, then you will have a community being protected from malaria. The nets have insecticide. However, over time, mosquitoes have also adapted to survive. Insects are constantly changing methods of avoiding the tools. In 2015, there was quite a considerable outbreak. It was very clear to see that insecticide resistance was playing a role. Uganda really took the lead in data collection to understand the level of resistance. They were able to make a data-driven decision on what is the best tool to deploy in the fight against malaria. That was our opportunity to come in with the third generation Permanent 3.0. Permanent 3.0 contains a synergist in the roof of the net. The synergist is called piperonyl butoxide, or PBO for short. When the mosquito tries to counteract the insecticide, PBO prevents that, so the mosquito will actually die. They found that the communities that were using PBO nets had less malaria than the communities using the conventional net. The biggest challenge we have in Uganda is we've become familiar with malaria. We need to communicate to the masses the importance of using the net every day, every night. The government is trying. It's trying level best to educate people and put people right. How to use the nets, how to hang them first before use. I hung it in the shed. After three days, the medicine is reduced. Now we sleep under nets. We are protected. These nets are now being deployed in 48 districts. These are areas where the mosquitoes are really stubborn. We must not become complacent with the speed and the intensity of insecticide resistance is spreading throughout Africa. We have to consistently innovate. We need to always design better, more effective, cheaper tools. We got to come out with innovations as fast as the mosquito mutates. We are compelled as policymakers, we are compelled as managers to move to provide solutions for the people of Uganda. This tool is hope.